hi and welcome to my home this is a quick video about <clears throat> my Simbano bag I'm gonna be going to dinner tonight with a friend so I'm not taking my whole allotment of things mainly because I don't like putting my bag on the floor I don't like using a hook I don't want to put it on the table we're going with a whole bunch of people so this can tuck on the chair back behind you on the chair if you're in a booth next to you pretty easy and what I really like about this bag is, well, the color is blue. They don't make this exact colorway right now, but they do have this bag on the website, and it's a Fiona shoulder bag. I bought this using Winnie B. LV's um, discount code, which I'll link in the in description box below. It works on sale items. So I don't remember how much I paid for this, but it was one of the first few things I bought. So this one is a plant-based, partially plant-based material. So it's it's a vegan product, I believe. It has, so this is like this leather material, and then this is a nylon on top here. So it's nylon here, here, and then it's trimmed in the same leather type plant-based material, and it has a really cool, um, nice drop. You can adjust it. I've never adjusted it. Um, but you can also just take these out too if you want to change out the strap. These have um, those little O clips that open. So you could take this whole strap out and use it as a clutch or change out the strap completely or take this off and use it. I've used a different chain with this. It's a really bright gold. Um, this is not a brass kind of finish. This is a gold finish. The um, This is really neat how it opens. And this is something I didn't really know when I bought it. So it closes like this like that and <clears throat> I've used this a couple times and it has an open cavity in a little slip pocket here it's a nice soft microfiber it has a zipper pocket back here um, it's a nylon zipper not a metal zipper which doesn't really matter to me um, and it has um, I never really use the bag zipper pockets anyhow um, I kind of forget they're there. I, I like bags of this shape that are open, one main open compartment. I um, I like the baguette, the Fendi baguette. I can't afford a baguette. <laughs> so I look for shapes of bags that are like the baguette, but aren't the baguette because I can't afford a baguette. It's like the way it is. So I got this bag with a bunch of other bags. I used her discount code. Um, the, it's... Um, win 26 i believe is her discount code i'll put it down but it works on sale items so i was able to buy like three different things i got a free gift with purchase um and out of all the simbano bags i have purchased this is my favorite this is probably also the only non-leather leather like material bag i have that isn't a poly coated canvas because i have had such bad luck with vegan leather polyurethane pu whatever you want to call it, um, because they kind of disintegrate, um, at least in my experience. There is a new product coming out called Cactus Leather, which is made out of cactus and all and um, plant-based materials and materials that are considered vegan, which means no animal cruelty involved. I'm more interested in the fact that this is using recycled plastic with plant material to make a bag. Plastic is not going anywhere in our society. It's everywhere, so might as well use it and repurpose it if we can, and this company is doing that. So I'm going out to dinner tonight. We're going to just throw my wallet in here. It's probably the only thing I'll take, and um, my phone, my wallet, everything will fit. There is no exterior pocket that doesn't need one. <clears throat> I really won't even open it. It'll just be a cute little bag for the evening. So anyway, thank you for watching, and check out this company. I like So far, I've had this stuff for over six months, used most of it and nothing has had issues um i had one bag that came in that had a defect um with the with the um paint not the paint what's it called um anyway they were they uh, sent out another replacement and they uh, refunded the money for that and that was that's because i live in texas and it's really hot and it just kind of melted and i think that's the one thing you do have to worry about though is um yeah, it was edge paint. The edge coating here is what melted on that bag. If you're living in extreme heat, um, and I'm talking like when this was delivered 
it was in the summer. You might as well, it was like 90 degrees outside. And it wasn't, I think it just got too hot. And, and the humidity combined with the heat had melted some of the edge paint. But that was the only one, <coughs> excuse me, that I had a problem with. And after that, the, these ones have had no issues with any of these. And I'm still in the same place, same state, same everything. So I think it was just that batch of bags. And it's not, obviously not this one. This one's been fine. So anyway, um, to check them out. Um, I have a video. Winnie has a couple videos on this company. Her, she, she's kind of stuck on the same style. I actually have different styles. So I really recommend this um, Fiona bag. Y'all have a good day. Bye.